Ladies and gentlemen, in the previous video we have seen the way we can use the BIM tool and we have seen some different settings which can help you to use a BIM tool. But now we are going to see a wonderful tool which is called a slab tool and see some different settings and its application on a house. Let's move on. I come here in the toolbox and I select the tool which is called slab. In the slab there is a geometry and positioning. Here I have the concrete structure as a basic slab or a composite slab where we use the generic slab loop. So let me use a basic slab. So here you can see that the height of the slab is 300 millimeter as the thickness of the slab and also it is positioned on zero so for it to be well visible let me first provide an enclosure so let me drag a copy this wall drag a copy to 600 6000 millimeter okay now let me back on the slab tool it is having like 300 millimeter thick so let me apply what you do is to specify the point and also that was the starting point and this is the end point let me check in 3d how it is looking like so you can see that our slab is applied the ground slab so I can also draw this slab in 3D. Select the slab, specify the point. I have specified the point and also that was the first point and I close by specifying the second point. You can see that our slab have covered the beam and the beam is having 300 millimeter. So let me use 600 millimeter so that our slab can be on the top of the beam so this is the way you can apply the slab but this is not enough so let's see whether you want to provide like change the color of the slab here let's use also activate the override surface and then I click on the sliding light and I link the surface yes and also this is the ground ground surface let me increase this surface of the slab the ground slab I have to use this tool and I do what we call offset all age like I offset on the 1000 millimeter which is equal to one meter so this is the way I can offset the slab so let me change its color as we have seen we use model and activate the surface the color of the top surface let me use like um, tiles the tiles here I found the tiles on the tiles turned 30 to 30 centimeter okay these are all the tiles and I change the column the beam let me use change on the model I use like um, paint titanium white and for the column I use let me choose the color which is also tone sliding or I use um, also paint titanium white so for having a great appearance and also for this lab I use the the same color but I mean the top slab only uh, paint titanium white okay for the wall I can use the black grid for the wall I can use the brick red yes 
okay now we have our slab on the top of this it seems like it is an opening hole so I just wanted to show you the way we can use for settings of the slab what if you want to make a hole in the slab so there is this subtract from the polygon I can subtract like a square check out 3d we found there is there is a, a hole here on the top and uh, I can also subscribe I can also subtract uh, this lab by providing here on the geometry method and I use the shape that it is not square I do it like this and then if you check uh, the 3d you find there is a, a hole here on the slab so this is the way that you can set our slab and try to change some different property of the slab so thanks for watching i wish to be with you in the following video tutorial